everybody, and I'd like to welcome you to my travel page. This is your host, Pellin. <coughs> Excuse me, and coming to Tulan City. You never see her province in the Philippines. And we're driving on a very busy day, heading to a restaurant to uh, try out some food for a venue that we booked for our little grandbaby's birthday slash christening. So the restaurant provided a sampling of the food and invited us to come down and try out a little bit of everything to see how we like it prior to that big day. So we're here cruising through the city and into the restaurant. You can see it's very busy. And so here's me and the big in the family. A few people came along. There's my lovely bride standing up there on the right, and her sister, and all the kids, and the star of the show, the little grandbaby there, Lalin. And the place is, was very nice, very nice looking. I think they serve mostly buffet meals. It's one of the, I think maybe this first or second time I've been to a place like that. I've never been to this restaurant before, so it was recommended from someone else if you want to hold a big gathering, a party. Price was very good, it was reasonable, considering we were having like 200 people. But you see all the decorations. Looks like it was a leftover from Valentine's Day. It was very pretty. The lights look like water coming down like a waterfall. All the hearts everywhere. Very nice, I have to say. And there's not many people here because we were there shortly before they started serving the lunchtime meal. They wanted us to arrive early, like at 10.30 in the morning. But a few people were still coming in have something to eat and I think the price of a meal was like between something I want to say between six to ten dollars for a buffet meal something like that so it would have been cheaper so a really good price I don't know my memory which I got a bad one someone said a meal was 200 or 300 pesos so that's four or six dollars Here's a little Lalin. She was more interested in playing with the uh, teddy bears more than anything. But she didn't disturb anybody. Like I say, it wasn't a very big crowd there. There's Grandma. Isn't she pretty? That's my lovely bride. She was chasing the baby, the grandbaby everywhere. So, and there's, that's Papa JR. Daddy. So, and here's the food. The food arrived. I have to say it was very good. It had a little bit of everything. To me, it was more than just a sampling. That was a whole meal. And they brought out more afterwards. I don't think I have that on the video. And then we bought more food, which why I don't know. Because <laughs> there was plenty enough food there to go around so that was pretty good Besides, we didn't have to pay for it because we we're already paid for it and they had pork dishes chicken pancit so the lechon was very good that's a, a pork dish and of course you got to have a big plate of rice it's Filipino meal so 
We sampled it all. Looked upstairs at the hall where the party was going to be held. Our theme was from the Disney movie Frozen because the baby she loves uh, Frozen. So we bought her a whole dress, the whole get up. Decorations with all of that you'll see in one of the upcoming videos. It was very nice. It was really pretty. It was one of the prettiest parties I, was, I ever attended and I paid for it. So it was nice and it was full. But you'll see that I think we did. This was prior to the virus outbreak, but <laughs> just shortly. I think this was around the 26th, 27th of February. The actual party took place, I think, on the 1st of March. And like I say, you all will see that in one of the upcoming videos. When I get some time, I'm very busy at my regular job, so I don't have a lot of time these days to make a lot of videos, but I will. So this was a vacation I was on in the Philippines from like the 22nd of March and I departed around the 9th of, no, the 22nd of February to the 9th of March. That's the date. Four or five days before the lockdown started. But anyway, there as you can see the food. There's the very sweet spaghetti that the kids and some of the adults love. Not me in particular. I don't like things. Sweet spaghetti is I guess, something you have to have an acquired taste for. The kids love it. With hot dogs in it. It's Filipino style. There's my lovely bride. and her sister next to her and our niece. So we had a good time. A good time in sampling all the food. It was very delicious, I have to say. That was very good, that pork dish. Excellent. And afterwards, we just sat around and talked. I would have liked to put in the background of the audio, but there was a lot of music there that YouTube would go, uh-uh, copyright infringement. Because they had some nice, some nice music playing in the background. And of course, there's Christine trying to make her child eat, but that kid never sat down for not even five seconds. She was all over the place. But it was all for her. We had a nice meal, bought a couple things to take with us, and we cruised on back home. So, there you see it. So, I think I'm just going to let the rest of this video run and hope everybody enjoy. And I'll say from the bottom of my heart and the whole family, thank you for always watching. Please always come back for more. Bye now, take care, be safe.